Hey, what's going on, Craig, aka Gigawatts? I've been asked a couple of times uh, about what quarter inch drive bits I use. I'm kind of a tool collector, so I thought I'd throw out a couple of. There's actually one missing, um, it's in my bag. I'll put it up later. Um, these are bits from uh, DDM, which Dave's Discount Motors. Um, they do uh, two, two and a half, three, four, and five, I believe. These are uh, some old Ofna bits. They actually come with a Phillips head and flathead screwdriver and a plastic case and a handle. Uh, these are Team Energy. Uh, these are the newest bits I just got. Um, I haven't used them much, so I'm not real familiar. My Ofna bits, the number two, because I use it all the time, has worn out. Um, this is a set of bits I just found uh, at Menards. Um, I'll put a link in the description on where you can get any of these. Um, this bit set's pretty cool. It... Uh, it has every standard bit from 0 0.05 all the way up to 3 16 and uh, actually all the way up to quarter inch in the standard size and then it has the 1.52, 2.53, 4.5 and 6 mil And then it comes with a handle. I think this bit sets like 10 bucks. But in the handle, you can put bits on. Let's get this in focus. You can put bits on either end. So if you're trying to get, you know, reach in there a long ways, you can use the long side. Or if you need more torque, you can use the short side. Uh. Like I said, I collect tools, so I have a ton of tools, and every time I find a new tool, I kind of add it to my arsenal. Because you never know when you're going to need that specific tool. And, uh... To get into that tight spot. I also, uh... Thought I'd show you this here. It's a pretty cool, pretty handy thing to have. It actually comes in a a box like this. I bought it at Walmart, but it's a ratchet for a quarter inch drive. Well, when you're working on like an eight scale buggy or uh, like this the, the uh, Arma Centon. The bottom uh, motor mount screw is very difficult to get to and it's a really tight spot. So you can use one of the short quarter inch drive bits in this thing and ratchet it out and that way you don't have to take that whole motor mount out. Um, it just happens that the Arma Centon motor plate has like red Loctite in it. So it's it's very difficult to get it out so if you're just going to move pinion gear and you just need to slide the motor you can loosen that bottom screw up slide the motor out and put the new pinion on slide it you know tighten it back up and you don't have to take the whole motor mount out in the case of the Arma Centon that's a real benefit if you have any questions if you have any comments, leave them below. And don't forget to like and subscribe. I'll be putting out more crazy videos in the future. Thank you for watching.